All right. Okay, next is the dinner organized for Felicia's stepfather, former judge of the Supreme Court, Justice George Oguntade, who was recently appointed Nigeria's High Commissioner to the United Kingdom. Yes, that dinner was organized by industrialist Alhaji Razak Okoya and his wife, Fola Shadi. So this time we head to the Oluwa Nishola mansion for the dinner. The story of the former Justice of the Supreme Court, Justice George Ogutade, is one wrapped with distinction and significant achievements. He is celebrated amongst his colleagues and indeed Nigerians as one of the brightest legal minds of the country with different landmark judgments to show for it. Justice Ogutani grew through the ranks and got to the position of the Justice of the Supreme Court in 2004, a position he held until he retired in 2010. This is 2017, and his experience and expertise is still sought after by so many distinguished Nigerians, including the President Mohamed Buhari, who recently appointed him as Nigeria's High Commissioner to the United Kingdom, a position many believe is well-deserving of a man with great achievements. Goodwill messages have continued to pour in from everyone, including his friend of over 40 years, the chairman of Eleganza Group, Chief Razak Okoya, who hosted a dinner party in his honor at his Oluwani Shalam mansion in Aja. The environment is just right, beautiful champagne gold and white decoration, and then all is set. Mommy, mommy, I'll come over. The man of the moment arrives. This dinner witnessed the convergence of Lagos socialites, business associates, friends and family members of the retired judge. Mrs. Fola Shade Okoya was on hand to welcome everyone. At this occasion is the former governor of a good state, Olusha Guashoba, the chairman of FCMB, Otumba Shibumi Balogu and wife, the chairman of Doi Group, Chief Samuel Adedoi and wife, and wife of the Ogun state governor, Mrs. Olufunsha Amosu, the chairman of the Premium Loto, Chief Kessentin Adebutu and wife, General Ike Nwachuku and wife, Chief Femi Pedro and wife, Senator Florence Itagiwa, the LCCI President Chief Nike Akode, Mrs. Maiden Ibru, Chief Senna Anthony, Mr. and Mrs. Ben Nwaru, amongst other well-respected guests. Goodwill messages from some of the dignitaries present. For someone to have reached the pinnacle 
of the Nigerian judiciary, and even at a, at a late age of over 77, being invited to be the representative of the Nigerian Republic and the Court of St. James, it's a very rare thing. I congratulate you. Uh, I'm confident that having made his mark in his chosen profession, he will do too well to represent this great country at the court of St. James. I congratulate you and your wife. God bless you. I pray the Almighty God that the Queen, which is head of the Commonwealth and head of the UK, will find you worthy. You and your darling wife, Duque. The celebrant, accompanied by his wife, Modupe, were called up to cut the celebration cake. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Zero. Please all join me in singing for his jolly good friend. For his a jolly good. For his a jolly good friend. For he's a jolly good fellow, and so say all of us. For the job, it will be excellent. You will promote Nigeria great. We will encourage a lot of visits into Nigerian society. We will do all necessary to help the country. By the time he finished, the country will be very happy with him that they have chosen the right person to be our representative in the United Kingdom. Justice Ogutade is truly grateful for this honor done to him. Everything we did here tonight has been very, very remarkable and impressive. Isn't it so? All glory and adoration go to God in the first place and in the second place to my friends who are who funded the garden here today. I'm talking of Are Okoya. Born on the 10th of March 1940, Justice Ogutade started his education at St. Michael's School, Ekwe, in 1946 and later proceeded to Ijebode Grammar School in 1953. He worked as a clerk before moving to the University of London where he obtained his law degree. Justice Ogutade has proven beyond every reasonable doubt to be trustworthy and well-deserving of this new position and his promise to serve in the interests of Nigerians. Here's wishing him all the best. Indeed, we wish him all the best with his new appointment. We do. And to all the celebrating also this October, if it's your birthday anniversary, we say congratulations. congratulations. This is where we draw the curtains on Metrofile today. It's been so much fun hanging out with you guys. But continue this online. Go to channelstv.com. Follow us on Twitter. You'll also reach us with the number blinking on your screens. Talk to us about the program if you want to. I am Anne Umawadu. And I'm Ogich Kuosu. Also remember that this edition of Metrify repeats on Saturday at 12 noon. And a fresh edition comes up on Sunday at 9.30 a.m. With, with a repeat broadcast on Wednesday 11 p.m. So please do watch out for it. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you again next Take care. week.